But now you probably heard about GPTs. I'm going to share a free one for consistent AI filmmaking. A GPT is a tailored version of ChatGPT. So the one I built will help you make better AI movies and also automate your workflow with Midjourney and other tools. I've shared the link in the description. You can use it right away. It's free. Let's get started. This GPT will help you create a consistent look across an entire AI film, and I'm going to show you how. So if you have a concept, you start by telling the AI assistant about that film concept. And just a brief synopsis is fine if you don't have lots of detail yet. So in my case, I'm going to tell it my story is about a robot named Real. He wants to save humanity from an evil robot. It takes place in Hong Kong. But his problem is humans don't trust AI, so he has to win them over to get the support he needs to stop the evil robot. And that's just about enough detail. You can even do a little bit less than that. So as a starting point, the assistant's going to help dissect what's good about your idea. And this is to help it internalize and make good recommendations, which it'll do for stylistic choices and your visuals, the camera and film stock, and the stuff that's going to show up in your prompts later, and the aspect ratio and the right color grading and mood for this to look consistent across the board and really fit the theme of your synopsis and concept. So we can see it's made some pretty heavy recommendations in here. So for style choices, neo-noir and cyberpunk visuals blended together, neon-led cityscapes of Hong Kong, which is gonna contrast with the mechanical nature of robots in this case. It's gonna give you camera recommendations and the film stock you wanna use that when you give it to something like Mid Journey, will give it very specific looks and feels, same with the aspect ratio. And what it'll do is use Dolly 3 to give you concept art to show you what it means by these stylistic recommendations. And these are things that are going to show up in your prompts later. So you can reply to it and revise things if you're not happy with it. But if you are, it's now going to give you a copy pasteable mid journey prompt format for this. So the latter half of it, you can basically just copy and paste into every single prompt. Uh, the GPT is also designed though to do that automatically for you as you're going to see later on. So let's get that going in mid journey. We're going to take the first prompt to recommend it as kind of a test prompt for us. And we'll see what that looks like in mid journey and get it cooking here. And while we're waiting, just to take a look at this baseline prompt. So what it's doing is taking all those recommendations about neo-noir cyberpunk style, the contrast, the camera and film stock, and ensuring that every shot is going to have that same part of it in it so that cinematically it's the same across every shot. So let's take a look here and you can see that, especially that I think the top right image came out really well. I might want to personally go back and talk to the GPT more and just tell it what I don't like and do like about the style. But for the sake of moving along, I'm just going to actually just describe a scene here so that we can see what this looks like as we start to apply it to more and more things. Eventually we'll get into a full shot list. So you can see that the latter half of the prompt is the exact same because stylistically we want to copy things, but it's changing things relevant to that scene as well. Things about the mood, things about the actual description of the, the people in it. And now we're going to create a shot list with this. And what it's going to do is first just kind of verify that you like what it's recommending to flesh this scene out. So you have different shots, you have an establishing shot so you know where you are. Then you're going to get into close-ups of characters and different things that really make this scene happen. And if you like it, what you're going to be able to do is proceed and make it all mid-journey prompts. So we're going to turn those seven uh, shots in the scene into seven mid-journey prompts you can copy and paste right away. And so this is completely streamlining the workflow of working with mid-journey. I'm going to be doing this for uh, DALI 3 in-app as well as Leonardo AI. So let's see what it looks like to have consistency across every shot in an AI film using this GPT to help us. Adam, our fears about our son have come true. You need to make a decision. What happened between you and I is no longer important. I can forgive you. We must focus on our son. So that's what I mean by consistency. And that was from an upcoming AI animation course I'm releasing soon. And it'll leverage this tool to help you quickly become a professional AI animator. If you don't have a story idea, this is actually gonna help a lot as well. I've trained you to dissect your favorite movies and characters. And what it's gonna do is help you understand what you actually like about those shows and extract the elements of it so you can work with the AI assistant on a completely original concept that's just infused with the traits of the shows and movies that you like. 
So you can see, even at this early stage, it gets that Breaking Bad is not just about crime, it's about moral dilemma and a character transformation that's critical to the show. So I will train this with time to be even better at dissecting these shows, and it'll pull these elements in and create a synopsis for you. So the idea isn't just to take a movie idea from the AI, it's to get your brain going and understand what you actually like about these movies and to workshop with the AI so that you can create a better story than if you didn't have anyone helping you. Once you feel like you're ready with the story too, you can just start the whole process again and get into creating the journey prompts and shot lists. And I'm gonna be adding a lot of teachings from my AI film school. So this is gonna act as a professional screenwriting assistant for you over time. You're gonna flesh out complete scenes, get dialogue in there as well. So while I'm working on the screenwriting stuff, I'm also gonna be helping you automate storyboards. You can actually just use DALI 3 right in this app and create storyboards, which you can bring to Midjourney or something else later, but you can also just see it in real time. And I'll put prompt formats so that you can do it in Leonardo AI, you can do it in DALI 3. You're not limited to Midjourney. And then this is all stuff that I can improve on a daily basis. So just comment on this video, tell me what you need help with, and I can improve the GPT pretty much in real time based on your insights and really help you get out amazing AI films. And that's the goal here.